Hey, what's up you guys? It's me, Sai, back with another video. This video is a little bit different from my regular videos. Like, I am doing a Sheen haul video. So, this is the second time I've ever bought from Sheen. The very first time I shopped at Sheen was actually for my mannequins. And I'm starting to browse because now I need new, pick, new outfits for my mannequin. And I'm noticing, I was like, oh my god, they have a men's section. I was like, shout out to Sheen for making these men's section because I honestly struggle with finding men's clothing that I actually want to wear and feel sexy in it, in it for going out and about. Now, what I'm about to show you guys is probably something I wouldn't wear like grocery shopping or something. It's pretty revealing. And I'm being really vulnerable right now with you guys because, you know, it shows a lot of skin. But I want to show you guys my first impression on how I feel about what I got, the quality and everything. So let's get right into it. So when you order your sheen, um, I mean, when you get your package, it's going to look something like this. And then I already opened it up. I haven't tried them on, but they come individual like this. I got to be careful because my cat's gonna try to chew on the bag and I don't think they're gonna like that if I have to return it. So without further ado, let's get right into this haul and I'll show you guys what I got and how I feel about it. Um, I'm so glad that they actually dedicated a section for men that are kind of like geared towards, um, I don't know. I feel like the outfits you will see mainly gay men wearing, I would say. I don't, I don't picture a heterosexual man wearing stuff like this, but I don't want to stereotype anyone. Anyone can wear this stuff, but honestly, I'm so glad they have this type of styling clothing for people like me, and uh, it's affordable. I know a lot of people are against Sheen, but I think, I mean, if I'm paying $8, $8 for a top and it looks this good, <laughs> you better believe I'm returning. So let's uh, dive right in. So I bought this first pink top uh i bought all larges because i am a little bit more on the mus muscular side so i don't know how it's gonna fit because my body's so shape weird but let's let's try it out so i'm also gonna end up putting pictures of the man, man model somewhere here blah, blah, blah. i'm actually gonna end up putting a picture of the model somewhere right here so you guys can have an idea of how it looks on your model and how it looks on a real person like me remember i'm only five three uh, I'm 165 pounds now. I'm not sure if you guys know, but I lost about 30 pounds. I went on um, a low carb, um, no sugar, no processed food diet for the last six months, and it really changed my life. But if you guys want to know more about uh, more about how I changed my life, leave a comment down below. Otherwise, we're not gonna get into that. We're gonna get right into this haul, like we're making this video for. So let me try this. Let me put this on real quick, and y'all can see how it looks. So this is the first top. This is a large, so obviously it fits really nice on me around my shoulders. I like the fact that it exposes a little skin, it exposes my tattoo. Obviously my nipples are always pointy. Um, I really don't know how I feel about this. I'm gonna insert a picture of the model somewhere right here. So yeah, how he's looking. I feel like most of these clothes are look better on taller men. But then again, it doesn't look too bad. Look. The back is given, honey. And then um, I feel like I want it a little bit more slimmer right here, but I might keep it. This is a large. The sleeves are a bit longer, but you're not going to get a perfect fit for something that that is from sheen that is like under ten dollars I, I like it it's cute and you know pink is my favorite color i might just keep it super cute the material is amazing you guys the material is so good quality i'm not gonna lie it don't feel cheap at all if i keep this it might even shrink if i uh wash it so that's our first outfit first um, impression very satisfied with the fit the quality and everything and it's not like I'm paying $100 for a top. I'm paying like $10 and under and I'm happy with so far with what I'm paying and what I'm getting, okay? This is the first one, super cute. I probably wear some white boots with this or I don't know what kind of shoes would I wear with this, but super cute. Okay, on to the next one. This one, uh, exposing a lot. I don't know how I feel about it, but I'm gonna show you guys. Okay, this is some bondage-ish. I loved it because 
it just showed I had to put on a jock strap because like on the picture his skin is showing so I'm not sure if he even have anything on if he has like a thinner thong but this is how it looks I'm not sure if it's actually supposed to ride your waist or it's supposed to be high waisted but I know I, I got too much gap around the waist this is the lot I'm showing you all okay this is some real bondage leather stuff I think it's super cute I am gonna leave a picture of how he look on the website and how I'm giving it out, you know? Super cute. I think I would definitely size down. I'm probably gonna get a medium. This is a large, but then again, it's super tight on my thighs because I do have a, a bigger set of thighs, but I'm looking and I'm not sure if it's supposed to be high waist or this part is actually supposed to be down here. But I mean, it's a little stiff. I would say uh, probably wear something underneath here maybe because you probably start getting hot underneath here but like are you wearing this to the grocery store you know this is probably meant for a night out or something but I need this to be like a little tighter okay so these are the pants I probably give it a 8 out of 10 I think it's really nice and I hope I don't get censored for this I'm not sure if guys can actually film videos with no top on. This sounds looking super cute. All right, so I'm gonna try one of the tops and I'll let you guys know what I feel about it. Okay, so this is the first top I bought. I personally feel it's a little bit too baggy for me. It's giving football player, it's giving wearing my brother's clothes. I like mine very tailored and form fitting because we trying to, you know, scope out the body. But it's nice, the material is nice, it's spandex. I like that it exposes the shoulder. This is a cute like outfit to wear out to the club or whatnot. Uh, this is a large. I probably do a medium or small depending on how I want it to fit. I mean the stitching on it is high quality. I did notice like on these pants, I'm not sure if you guys kind of see it, but they didn't finish the stitching on. Well, they did, but okay, never mind. The yarn just coming off. Hopefully this this doesn't rip open. Um. But yeah, this is nice. I think I'm gonna exchange this for a smaller size. I really like the comfort, how it feels on my skin and just how it looks. Super cute. Just a little bit too long for me. I like mine to be lifted, like almost like a longer crop top almost. But this fit might be for someone else that's trying to wear a different way. So super cute. Love it. I'm I'm so I'm super satisfied so far. Okay, you guys. So I ended up getting this tank top too. It's super cute. I like that it's a little bit oversized, like it hangs down to around my hip area. Um, this would be a cute tank top to wear out with a layer if it's a little cold. I'm not a fashion expert, but super cute. This um, I don't know what they call it, this button up. I just threw on real quick. But I'm show you guys how it looks with all the button up. I'm not sure if you can actually show nipples on YouTube or not. I hope they don't take this video down. Um, but yeah, this tank top I'm definitely keeping. I don't know if I would actually wear it as is. I just don't feel comfortable wearing it as is. It don't look right. I think a cute top over it as layers would be cute. Otherwise by itself, hmm. I don't know, would you guys wear this by, by itself? But super cute. Definitely satisfied with this tank top. Um, I got three more, well, two more items. I can show you guys, but the rest of the order, cause I did end up ordering more like jackets and stuff, but you know, all this stuff is coming from China. I don't know when it's gonna get here and I will be leaving out of town soon. So I wanted to make this video before I left. Okay, all right, you guys, I absolutely love this. This is by far my favorite so far. I feel like me, I feel like myself, I feel like it does show like, my skin and everything but it's like shadowed a little bit if that makes any sense super cute show you the back obviously th these outfits are revealing and they're not meant to go out and about in the public i mean there's no rules you can but i personally will wear something like this to a really like dramatic event or exotic event you might get even strip in it you know um, or like the nightclubs and stuff like a, a different type of nightclub, but super cute It shows a lot of the shoulders a lot of the arms and it shows the stomach 
I'm obsessed with these pants. I wish they fit me a little better because I like the fact that it shows the hips off. It's very sexual, very sexy. All right, favorite top out of them all, and it's so comfortable. I can wear this all day. All right, let's move on to our next top. Okay, here's this one. I personally feel it's amazing. I just feel like I'm having a hard time with the back. I'm not sure because my back's so like tapered, like re-tapered. I'm not sure if it's just like, I don't, know, I don't even know how it looked in the back. But I just feel like it definitely does my body right. It shapes out my body. But this is a large, you guys. This is a large. Could you imagine me trying to put on a small object like this? Super cute. I like the fact that it tailors the neck. I can wear some long type of necklace. Um, it, sh it sh exposes a little bit of skin, but not too much. And I'm not sure if you guys can see the glitter. Super cute. And it really does shape out the arms too. Cute. I'm keeping this one for sure. You know what? I'm buying all this stuff and I'm saying keep it. I wonder if I'm actually going to have the, the courage to actually wear it out or find a, a place to wear it. But I will, you guys. That will be my mission to go out and look very cute in these outfits. Okay, one more top and then I'll probably make a part two video when the rest of the stuff comes. I seen this one online. I had to get it. I think I have it on backwards. Maybe the, one, the thing about this is it doesn't have... Like, it doesn't have, like, a tag on the collar, so you don't really know. Let me try to rotate this. Because it does feel kind of like the back is lifting up a little bit. Oh, my goodness. I should have just took it off first. Okay. I struggle with this hair. Okay, this feels a lot better now. I feel like it's better fitting. I don't know how to feel about this. What do you guys think? Um, I feel like I probably would size down. I'd probably get a medium for this since there's so much like roll up happening right here. Like the sleeves are rolling up. I want them a little bit tight, tight fitting. And I like the fact that this is here, but I would like it to be like right here. So this is super cute. You could probably layer this with a blazer or something. Um, and I'll show you guys close up the material. Super cute. I'm so glad that Sheen decided to come out with like a men's line that are for more of the glamorous boys out there. Um, I don't want these pants, girl. <sighs> it get hot in these pants. I don't know how people wear them. Uh, but yeah, that is everything I have for today. I'll do a part two. And I'm going to end this video with what I think about everything. But I'm back to my regular clothing. I would say I'm pretty happy with my purchase. I'm definitely going to make my rounds about and go buy more. Um, especially when I like keep on wearing these outfits over and over. I hope they hire on more designers. Or I don't know how Sheen finds their design that they steal from other people. Who knows? Oh my god. Rock gets starting to bite the bag. No baby. Don't do that. We won't be able to return it. Okay, anyways, I had to put Rock in the way for a little bit. He was starting to bite the bag, and I'm pretty sure Sheen, Sheen, however you pronounce the name, would not appreciate me trying to return packages with teeth marks in it. They're going to be like, man, he must have been hungry or something. Anyways, I personally am happy with my purchase. I feel like it's one thing when I buy something that is like 500 or more, and I get it, and it's cheap. The stitching's horrible, it feels cheap, and then I spent a lot of money versus paying like $5, $6, $8 for a top, and then it feeling cheap. Then you, do, you don't feel bad because it's only a couple dollars, right? Um, but they were, it really uh, met, met my needs, you know, met my needs on trying to look cute on a budget, and that's what I was looking for. And also, it's cute going out outfits. So that's my take and my review on Sheen for Men. I don't know if you guys have bought from them, leave a comment down below. If you have outfits or if you're a Sheen fan, uh, leave a comment down below. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Until the next video, bye.